guys. We made it. And yes, I am filming this video a day ahead. And like, at, immediately after filming my previous video. But like, those are very small details. And it doesn't matter. Because I did it. <laughs> I have posted a video every day for a whole month of April. And I'm like, I'm stunned that I actually am finishing this. So at the, at the very end of Vita, I wanted to uh, just sort of look back on the experience of completing Vita. Um, and I decided to do this in the way that one of my professors in college uh, sort of organized writing critiques. Um, so there's four things, positive, negative, questions, and suggestions. We'll start with positive. Uh, I made 30 videos, guys. This is like a huge, it's very possible that in the last month I have made as many videos as I had in the in, an entire year before then. Because I was so sp always so sporadic with making videos. Um, I got a chance to make a lot of videos that I have been meaning to make. Um, I got to uh, talk about uh, demisexuality, I got to talk a lot about my faith and uh, some of the elements of that. Um, I made so many friends with uh, doing Vita and people who were also doing Vita, Vita or attempting to do Vita. Um, and I am so proud of every single one of you guys. Uh, I, I don't think I can say that enough. Next up is negative. Because um, not everything is going to be peachy keen. I definitely phoned it in on a couple of videos. While I am proud that I did something every single day, there are a handful of videos that I'm not super proud of. Um, and the really annoying part is that I'm not going to be able to take them down or like make them private because then the playlist would be incomplete and I can't let myself do that. Um, so yeah, that's not, not too excited about that. Um, it also, uh, Vita kind of like sucked away at any like creative and retrospective energy. I feel like where I would normally put more energy into social media and Twitter and journaling and uh, some stuff that doesn't necessarily get seen to a broader audience like YouTube, um, I, I funnel all of that into my YouTube videos. Um, so that was kind of like mixed. Uh, some of it was good, but I basically stopped using social media, especially Twitter, the way that I usually do. Um, and that, like, I was not excited about that. So number three, third thing in this is questions. Um, I think the big question is, that I have for me, is uh, will I continue to make videos for myself in this way? Uh, the answer, if you couldn't tell from the last bit, no. Um, I'm going to be doing it a little bit differently. But um, I, I think this has once again, been like a really great experiment to know that I can do things this way. Um, I also wanted to put out a question to you guys, for those of you who participated in Vita, what was your favorite video that you made? Because um, I want to know. I want to know what you're most proud of from this month. Um, and for the record, the answer for that to me is the demisexuality one and the prophecy and me. I'll put those links down below or I'll link to them at the end of the video. Um, and then number four, suggestions. Um, this is another one where I do want to hear from you guys. Uh, if you guys have any thoughts and things that you want to say about how this worked out this month, I would love to hear it. I know this voice doesn't sound like I do, but I really want to hear uh, what you guys have to say and uh, if you have, do have any suggestions, um, if there are any videos that could be like repeated or like variations on a theme kind of thing, um, and you're interested in seeing that, 
please let me know because uh, there are a handful of videos that I made this month that I could do with the, like the same idea with different uh, topics. I'm thinking specifically of the headcanon sexuality and the uh, uh, time traveling, television time traveling video. Um, if you're interested in seeing more of that, I I would love to do more of both of those or others. Um, there are definitely a couple of ideas that I want to get into. Uh, things like perhaps making a channel trailer now that I have a lot of video footage to pull from. Um, and I kind of want to do like a little bit of more branding stuff as well. Uh, so yeah, Vita 2016. Uh, that's about all I have to say about that, for now at least. Um, if you guys have questions, comments, concerns, please do leave them down below. I would love to hear from you guys. I always love to hear from you guys. Um, if you ha have been finding these videos interesting and you're not subscribed, do it! I would love it! Um, and as always, uh, I hope you guys got a chance to do something that you love today. I will not see you tomorrow, but I will see you next time. Bye, guys.